I am Don. I'm Don Wilkes, the UPU Security Program Manager, and I would like to welcome each of you today to our road safety webinar, which is the second in our series and the first to be held in English. Thank you for taking some time today to join this webinar on this very important topic, which affects each and every one of us in both our professional and personal lives. If you have questions, please put them into the chat box or the question uh, and answer box. And both myself and my colleague, Ms. Lei Wang, who is online, will review them and get them to our speaker. If we're unable to answer them in the webinar, we will get them answered for you after the webinar and provide uh, an entire list of the questions and answers. So without further ado, I would like to uh, thank everyone again and hand the floor over to the chair of the Universal Postal Union Road Safety Group Expert Team to continue the webinar. Uh, Mr. Gihern, please, you have the floor. Thank you, Don. Uh, welcome, uh, everybody. Um, I hope you are listening and seeing well. And good morning, good afternoon, and uh, or good evening, um, depending where uh, you are. Uh, this is a, a, this presentation has four parts, as you see. Uh, uh, I will talk to you about corporate fleets around the world, uh, about postal fleets and the, 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 the link with pillars of sustainable development. I will talk to you about the road safety program of CTT. And uh, at least at last, uh, I will talk to you about uh, the initiative, uh, the OPU initiative uh, related with road safety. So let's begin with um, with the, the corporate fleets around the world. Um, the, the, the world's car fleet uh, is, uh, has a dimension on a scale uh, of the population itself. Um, uh, there are uh, estimates pointing to more than 1.4 billion vehicles in the world. Uh, and uh, this, uh, must be only the registered vehicles. Um, I think there are much more vehicles than, than this. Um, about 30% um, of this fleet, these vehicles, are uh, vehicles, uh, are cargo and distribution vehicles. Uh, or about uh, 400 million vehicles. And we know that the, 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 those vehicles have a, 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 an important uh, intense activity. Um, in posts, uh, we stop uh, many times uh, uh, along the, our, our uh, route. Um, and um, so we know that these 30% of uh, vehicles have uh, much more um, um, impact uh, when we think about the consumption. Um, we can say that about uh, the, the, those vehicles uh, has uh, about 70% of the consu consumption of all the, the, the this fleet. Um, this, the operation of this fleet has great difficulties when we think about uh, urban operation, um, a chaotic uh, traffic, um, increased risks, uh, not only safety, but also security, um, an impact, important impact on the environment and road safety. Um, so um, we don't we must re remember 
that we have about uh, 1.35 million people die every year as a result of road accidents. And there are much more, about, still, uh, about uh, 30 to 40 million people injured, some of them, uh, many of them, uh, seriously injured. Uh, the road accidents are a public health problem, um, and uh, it's a World uh, Health Organization that says this, because um, uh, it's the leading cause of death for young people. So we, we lost many young uh, uh, men and women uh, in health accidents. And the, the post uh, the post companies has uh, uh, a strong impact also. Um, we have uh, about um, uh, five million, five point two million employees across all postal operators, and uh, I'm talking. I think it's only direct um, uh, employees. Uh, we know that uh, we work with lots of companies uh, that work for posts, so the the total number must be uh, much more uh, uh, much bigger uh, we have a, a, a network uh, of about 666,000 uh, postal stores and uh, the fleet uh, I, I I estimate that we have about 1.5 million vehicles in the in post um, there is no an official number. Uh, and I think the, also that uh, uh, we have many vehicles uh, without register, and uh, so the, the the real number must be um, bigger. We have also uh, a problem uh, of information uh, about road accidents, but this not only uh, posts. It's a problem, a, a global problem. Um, but um, uh, taking into account the type of this activity um, and the, the number of the, the, the fleet and the number of employees, um, I'm sure that we have some thousands of deaths uh, and tens of thousands of accidents at work with serious consequences. So we don't have any doubt um, that uh, when talk about fleets, we are talking also uh, about uh, SDGs. Um, they are, there are 17 uh, sustainable development goals of the United Nations. Um, I, uh, I think that almost all of these 17 uh, uh, are sustainable development goals are linked with road accidents and are linked with fleets. Um, even the, the same that it's not uh, uh, direct, but like hunger and poverty and the, and the training um is um we can uh, have we have uh, links with road accidents because when we have an accident uh, we have a worker uh, injured or, or dead uh, we have a family behind this this worker uh, we have a family with problems for the future uh, we have children with uh, problems uh, in the uh, training, in the, in the education, and uh, later uh, with uh, with uh, problems in the, in the in jobs. So uh, we have uh, we know we have a special um, paper, a special role on the on the sustainability, 
uh, and post companies uh, must do uh, uh, everything we can. Uh, all of us, uh, not only, of course, the, the postal companies, but uh, all the fleets and uh, all uh, each uh, citizen must uh, must have this this uh, um, uh, responsibility. Uh, we can do uh, lots of things uh, in companies and outside in the uh, civil society. Um, and uh, um, uh, it's important uh, that we have this um, uh, in, uh, in our uh, mind. The, we, we live in a, in a global world and uh, road safety is a global problem. Uh, um, and um, uh, the society and the many pe um, uh, people all around the world uh, is uh, working uh, in uh, road uh, safety. Uh, and uh, we had in uh, 2020 um, the uh, Stockholm Declaration, uh, which um, uh, declared a very important challenge for the for this uh, decade. Uh, we um, want. Uh, to reduce uh, um, fifty percent in deaths and injuries, and it's the first time uh, uh, we talk about reduction in, in injuries. Um, usually, we talk about reduction in deaths, but uh, uh, we we have, uh, as we, I told before, uh, thirty to forty millions people injured um, and uh, in, a, in a decade we are talking we, uh, about uh, 300 or 400 million people so it's very important also to, to look at the injuries and work to reduce 50 percent to the end of this decade uh, it's 2030 uh, it, uh, missing, uh, we have uh, uh, seven years, and uh, we have lots, lots of things to do. Because um, if we don't work uh, now, we don't. If don't work every day till twenty thirty, uh, we will not have those uh, goals uh, in that uh, date. The Stockholm Declaration uh, calls call on companies and industries. It's not uh, only for uh, for governments, for uh, out, uh, for um, countries. But it's 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 also for companies. It's also for industries of all sizes and sectors. The, all are uh, we must contribute to the achievements of these. Uh, SDGs related to road safety, applying safe systems principles uh, to their uh, entire value chain, uh, including internal practices, uh, procurement, production, distribution, um, and uh, to put uh, road safety in uh, our sustainability reports. Uh, we know that uh, many companies uh, report uh, have uh, sustainability reports. Um, it's nice to say in this moment, it's very sexy to say we have um, 100, 200, 1,000, 2,000 electric vehicles, but uh, we must also to talk about road safety because I'm sorry, but uh, sustainable to, uh, needs to, uh, to be also uh, safe. So um, we have a big challenge uh, to 
uh, in our uh, in the, the next years, uh, beginning now. Uh, and we don't. We must uh, also, uh, uh, as a result of the Stockholm Declaration, uh, we have now a global plan for the decade of action. Uh, this global plan uh, reinforces the importance of holistic view of road safety. And uh, it uh, talks about uh, the importance of fleets to achieve the proposed objectives. And, and must, uh, we, have, we must have programs to ensure safe operation, uh, avoiding excessive speed, uh, with driving time limits for the distributors and the control of driver behavior through appropriate devices. Devices, as you know, uh, we have lots of uh, of solutions like uh, telematics. Um, we uh, the in the global plan is recommended also the training for all drivers, without forgetting the two wheelers. Uh, in fleets, uh, you know that we have lots of accidents in two-wheel vehicles. Uh, I can tell you, in CTT, we have the mo most of them uh, accidents are with two-wheel, including suppliers. We don't, we can't forget. We, we work with lots of companies with lots of um, uh, that work for for our companies. And we must uh, also, uh, such as uh, we must um, um, tell them that they ha must have uh, electric vehicles. Uh, we must also tell them they ha must have uh, road safety plans and uh, to uh, reduce accidents. Now I will talk you. Uh, a little about the CDT, and I began. I, I, I must tell you who we, we are. We are the Portuguese uh, Universal Postal Operator in Portugal, uh, CTT Correios uh, de Portugal. We are the major, uh, a major employer in Portugal uh, with more than 12 employees. We have also operations in other countries like Spain and, and Mozambique. Um, we have uh, uh, 600 stores and uh, more, almost uh, 2,000 agents that receive daily uh, about 130,000 customers. Um, we have one of the largest and most modern fleets in Portugal with around four. 4,000 vehicles and a global activity of 7 million kilometers a year. And we have also one other fleet the, the outs uh, outsourced with about the, sa the same activity, about 60, 70 million kilometers. So, uh, we consider sustainability crucial uh, in our commitment. Um, and um, we start uh, this program in 2000, 2015, um, uh, looking for the, the, the accidents we had uh, in the previous year, in 2014. In that year, we had about um, uh, 447 seven road accidents at work, uh, which result in uh, 70, 17,000 days lost uh, with absenteeism. Um, and we had also more about uh, 1,200 accidents only with material damage without uh, um, people uh, injured. Um, the direct cost of these uh, days lost and this uh, material damage uh, was more than 2.4 million euros. 
we know uh, as uh, the people who, who knows more, much more about uh, road accidents and road safety, that the global cost of road safety is um, of road accidents uh, is five to four or six times the direct cost. So we know that we have a much more a bigger uh, cost uh, and uh, um, to show this, uh, a very recent study of uh, the National Agency of uh, Road Safety in Portugal uh, says that uh, each death in Portugal has, has a cost, uh, economic and social, of 3 million euros. Um, we, we have thousands of uh, drivers, driver, thousands of workers driving um, every day uh, in our streets and uh, in our roads. So we must uh, focus, we must do everything uh, on people. Uh, our workers, CTT drivers, and also the postmen, the walkmen of postmen, uh, and uh, the other drivers and the other pedestrians, because we, uh, we must uh, work for um, a road safety um, environment, uh, the streets and the roads safe. Uh, we want to work road safety in CTT uh, with uh, all the components, all the, the, the help of all, all the departments of the company. Uh, the, a road accident is not a problem of a driver or uh, a local manager. It's a problem of all the company. Uh, <laughs> Human resources uh, has responsibility. Uh, people who uh, buy the, the vehicles um, has responsibility. Um, the company must uh, has a, a policy uh, to uh, highlight to to show the good practice and to uh, reward the best drivers and the best teams and. Um, we have also, uh, we need also a strong uh, work of communication because we have thousands of workers uh, across all the world, the, across all the country. And um, it's, it's important to, to, to go to every place, to all, uh, each of uh, these workers. So uh, we um, we um, organized a set of uh, working groups, uh, seven working groups, each one uh, on a, a specific topic: uh, accident diagnosis, training and awareness, vehicles, new drivers, recognition, accident control, and communication. Each one of these working group has the, the different uh, departments uh, working uh, in, in uh, these uh, working groups. We start looking for uh, the accidents in 2014, um, and we uh, it was very important to, to know how uh, the accidents happen, what kind of accidents uh, uh, and um, it, it's, uh, it's important for to, 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 to know what actions we, we need to do uh, after. We, uh, we also uh, have review and improve the control and information model because uh, it's uh, without knowing the, the exact numbers, we can't manage nothing and the road accidents and road safety is the same. We need numbers, we need um, um, information to, to control and to, uh, to, to manage uh, this. Uh, 
this um, well I'm lost I, I heard the the timer stop no problem um we might uh, some um, uh, some uh, um, we looked also to the vehicles uh, uh, we looked the safety equipment and uh, linked with the accidents we uh, made some um, um, changes in the, the safety equipments and the uh, speed and the, and the sensors uh, reverse uh, on light commercial vehicles uh, some uh, changes we looked also uh, for new drivers we have uh, many accidents with new drivers uh, and we um, um, because they are uh, usually they are young uh, they are uh, they don't have enough experience driving uh, so um, uh, we know that they uh, they they don't sink the risks they don't know the risks they 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 have and also um, they think they have more um, uh, control on the vehicles uh, and they don't. So um, we uh, defined a specific training model for the new drivers and also for their um, uh, local managers. It's important to, to, to um, tell the local managers what they uh, they must know about young drivers and what they must do uh, about young drivers. So we uh, prepared also the, the local managers. And recognition, uh, we make this with uh, um, choosing uh, our best teams and making uh, a, a competition uh, with um, uh, road safety uh, and uh, um, uh, eco driving um, components uh, uh, and reward the, the best uh, drivers. We uh, do lots of things of com communications. So we improved the, 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 the control model also. Uh, we um, we use um, um, when when um, as part of the control we have a program of uh, technical visits, which uh, site uh, and we check the vehicles. Uh, it's very important uh, to 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 uh, to have the vehicles in good conditions and safe conditions. And uh, if uh, some, uh, so if any vehicle uh, has a high risk uh, situation, is stopped and uh, you only uh, go to work after the situation is uh, resolved. Um, the most important of this program is uh, uh, to save lives, to reduce accidents. And this is the most important, and this is our goal. Um, since 2015, uh, we um, we reduced about eighty, more than eighty thousand days. Uh, if I consider twenty twenty two, we will reduce almost ninety thousand. Um, and this is only what uh, we reduced in absenteeism, because uh, we know that uh, the, uh, a road accident has much more costs, uh, and um, it's uh, as I told before, uh, the number, the total number, is much higher. Uh, Socially, uh, the reduction of accidents uh, contributes to less suffering for the, the victims, for their families and colleagues. Um, 
and uh, we don't have the problem to need to hire uh, other workers. Um, and uh, we have also environmental, financial, and sustainable impacts. We have better use of vehicles. Uh, we uh, uh, road safety um, is um, closely linked with eco efficient uh, driving. Uh, when we make a safe driving, we make also a eco driving. Uh, so we uh, the consumption uh, is reduced reduced. Um, and uh, we have also uh, a rationalization energy program for the fleet. And uh, these uh, two actions, road safety and uh, rationalization energy, uh, are uh, uh, in the same time. Uh, and also, of course, the, this program has uh, benefits for uh, for the companies uh, who make uh, works like this. Um, we have uh, several indicators. Um, um, here we have the the, 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 the global numbers. Uh, we began uh, with seventeen thousand days lost and uh, 447 uh, accidents in 20 uh, workers uh, accidents at work in 2014. Um, in the last years, 2020, 2021, and 22, we had about 250 accidents and we lost uh, about uh, 6,000 uh, days. Um, and we, we, we had, uh, at the same time, um, uh, a fleet activity increase. Uh, usually, um, road, uh, road accidents were the, the, the main cause of, uh, of absenteeism in city. Um, it's the, it's the blue line. I don't, I don't, I can't, I can't do it. But it's the blue line. Uh, as you see, uh, we were reducing into 2019. We had a, a big accident and we lost here the, 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 the reduction we had. Uh, it was uh, just in the last days of the, the year. But uh, in 2020, 21, and 22, we are at the same level. And uh, the other accidents, the yellow, um, the yellow line uh, is um, is uh, stable. We have uh, one other indicator, uh, interesting, that it's the number of days of absenteeism per, uh, per million kilometer. Um, in 2024, in 2014, we had uh, about 436 workdays lost by a million kilometers. Uh, 2020, 2021, 20, and 2022, we have about 100 uh, days lost by a million kilometers. So this um, tell us that we reduced um, about 75% of this, this indicator. And we must um, also uh, look the numbers of uh, participations in health safety training. In 2014, we had a very small number of participations. Um, we were increasing and uh, now we have about uh, 30,000 um, participation uh, each year. Um, we need to remember all the time uh, um, and we um, we um, um, disseminate contents related with our accidents and um, also uh, sharing 
the, the results and the showing the, the better teams we have in, in CTT. Um, in CTT, uh, after uh, or since 2015, this work uh, has uh, it, it was important to make to develop uh, a road safety culture um, because um, uh, after all these years, after um, hundreds of thousands of participations in road safety actions. Um, um, sharing the response, um, showing the, that the responsibility is of all of us. Um, we are, um, we, we developed uh, here a uh, uh, road safety uh, culture. And uh, the work is uh, with all the others. We can't do these alone in the operations or in fleet management or uh, everybody has um, the, uh, is important for, for these results. Uh, and especially also the, the local managers, they have their, their vehicles, they have their, their drivers. And um, so we have lots of actions. Uh, we, uh, every year, we make the diagnosis of the previous year. Uh, we um, mostly we, we see the, the trends of the indicators. Uh, and um, every year, we make a new program for the next year. Um, we think we have uh, some um, special um, special um, actions that um, are important and are um, are different in CTT program. Um, this intervention of all the departments. Uh, a dynamic program. We we learn every time. We we when we see the the difference on the indicators, we go and we look for what happened, and we learn uh, something more, and we adjust uh, new actions uh, or new training actions to uh, the, 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 the that to solve that problem. It's a problem with continuity. Um, we are working um, uh, eight years in this moment. Um, information is uh, important, of course. Inter intensive cooperation with all levels of management, from the local manager, as I told you before, but also uh, highlighting the top management and the strong support we have of our CEO, João Bento. And the, the recognition we make with a, a nice uh, competition, Driver Challenge, uh, it's, um, it's, um, it's important to, 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 to have uh, drivers for, for, from different parts of the country um, in, the, um, in a, a nice meeting. And a nice competition, of course. Um, and a very strong, important paper of communication. We, as I told, we have thousands of, of drivers uh, across all the country. So we must uh, go there uh, and we must use uh, all the channels we need, we, we have. Uh, and um, we um, we use all the the, the available uh, solutions. Um, and the, the important message uh, we have is that uh, road accidents, road, uh, it's not a fatality in one accident. Uh, the road accidents can be managed road safety can be managed, we can reduce accidents, we can reduce deaths, 
we can reduce injuries. Um, and it's worth uh, com making, uh, fighting this, this battle um, because uh, it's the most important thing. So we, we replace a vehicle, we don't replace uh, a, pe a person. This is the this is the the page of our um, project on uh, CTT Internet. Uh, as you know, as you see, uh, my colleagues of communication uh, had the, this idea uh, because we must remember our drivers the, that they have a family, they, they have children, and uh, they must um, uh, go home in the end of the day safe. So uh, it's more important to go there safe than uh, um, the speeding uh, uh, and uh, uh, have risks uh, in the in the road. Uh, in this page, we have uh, dozens, uh, more than one hundred contents we make uh, of all the actions uh, in these years. And these documents are available um, all the time for local managers to uh, uh, so they can develop actions um, on their own initiative um, and when they uh, think that they need. Um, Booking the time. Okay. Um, I, I'm trying to show you a small, a small, um, a small, uh, yes, a small uh, video. Uh, not the. Um, sorry. Preparado? Flex it. Viajar a partir de dois euros e noventa e nove é claramente um sinal. Yes, this is the, the video. I, I hope you are uh, seeing the, the, the itself. Uh, it was the, the last international driver challenge. Yes, so first of all, thank you very much, CCT, for organizing and hosting this event. Uh, uh, we understand the amount of work that you have to invest to have an event uh, like this. Uh, so the recommendations, uh, I don't have a lot of recommendations. I saw that the program is pretty, uh, pretty complete, uh, that uh, you have taken uh, the best exercises uh, that also give uh, a lot of uh, uh, learning to the drivers. So that's great. Well, road safety is becoming for more and more members key. Um, we are working on behavior and uh, uh, this is just the tip of the iceberg. Many posts are doing domestic and regional exercises on working on the behavior and uh, I think we are getting slowly but rightly moving in the right direction and getting better on road safety. Efficiency is not only uh, a social program, corporate social responsibility is also a profitable question, a question of profitability. And uh, what we see is the more intense the posts are working on CO2 efficiency, we also become more uh, profitable, which is a key topic. And uh, this, is, uh, this can be done by uh, investments in better technology, but it also has to do a lot with the behavior of, of staff. Uh, the biggest steps, I believe, in the future will be done by more uh, uh, better behavior of um, uh, staff and that will lead to higher efficiency steps and that's why these exercises are truly important. On est vraiment très très heureux d'être d'être ici aujourd'hui, aujourd'hui et demain, aujourd'hui c'est l'entraînement et demain c'est la vraie compétition. Il y a une vraie émulation, une vraie préparation, c'est très sérieux. Euh, comme le sujet, l'environnement, euh, les gaz à effet de serre, le carbone, c'est un sujet sérieux. Et aujourd'hui, on sent bien qu'il y a une préparation très sérieuse pour, pour demain euh, être prêt. On est très très, très content, on a l'ambition de faire euh, aussi bien que la première édition. La France avait gagné euh, la première édition, donc on est, euh, on est très concentré, euh, on est très motivé.
was with a clear distance of 6% to the one before. So 92 was the number second, 98 is the number one. Clear winner, so no doubts. We checked with all legal parties you needed to check with, and uh, it is CTT. O melhor balanço possível. É, em termos de Penso que o importante é. Oh, sorry. The important. Um... Okay, sorry. Okay. Um, this is important because we can show uh, the best drivers, and this is only the 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 end of a, 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 a big process. Uh, we work uh, training, uh, good uh, driving, safe driving. We choose uh, our best teams uh, that are. Uh, we began with. Uh, uh, dozens of, of teams. Um, we have our national competition uh, every year, and uh, uh, the the winners of uh, each country go to this international uh, driver challenge. Here uh, we have the national one uh, of the the national uh, uh, competition, and it's very important to 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 do this and to show uh, and reward the best drivers. Um, we have also um, um, special important days like European Road Safety Days. Um, and we um, we uh, want to, to share with everybody our commitment with road safety. Uh, each uh, worker makes his own commitment and show uh, in public, uh, the, the, their commitment. The, the awards are important, uh, uh, but uh, of course, the, the most important are the results. Uh, but uh, I, I, I must recognize that the awards we receive uh, are important stimulus for the work, uh, for this work. I don't know if we didn't have the, these awards, uh, if this uh, project would be. Uh, just the same. Uh, we received the first award in 2017 from the European Road Safety uh, Chart. Uh, if, and the, from uh, in the same year, from Instituto Pará, uh, Brazil. We received the prize award from the European Transport Safety Council in 2018. Uh, in 2019, we received the manager with purpose from Pará, Brazil and the firm, uh, fleet manager uh, of the year from the fleet manager magazine in Portugal. Uh, in uh, 2021, we received a nomination for the DECLA award. Uh, in 2021, we received the Prince Michael International Road Safety Award. And you don't see the, these small lines, but I have very important small lines. And uh, in last year, we received a nomination for the European Road Safety Award. Um, we have um, we have lots of uh, challenge for the future. Uh, if we want to reduce for half the deaths and the injuries in uh, road accidents, we need to do lots of things, and we have small time. Uh, but we must uh, look for. Uh, we must go on keeping a careful monitoring of the, the, the evolution, uh, co uh, continue the target training and awareness effort, um, training for new vehicle models, and uh, we have electric vehicles, um, uh, consolidate the model of recognition of teams and drivers. Uh, uh, we have e-commerce, and uh, e-commerce is a, a big challenge because uh, it's very important for our companies, of course, but we must uh, also think that it has more risks and we must uh, work uh, in reducing those risks. Um, and uh, the last, and I think the most important thing I can share with you 
is the initiative from UPU uh, related with health safety. It's a very important uh, that initiative. Um, um, we have many countries in the world with a high rate of road accidents. Um, and um, we must uh, look for postal companies. Uh, we must disseminate good health safety practice, like in this webinar, and uh, inviting uh, other operators with good, also good uh, practice and sharing uh, also. Um, uh, we want to, to have a guide for the development and implementation of a road safety program. It's, it's only a guide measure. But but is it's important for for the, the operators to, that don't, doesn't have a, a still a problem. Uh, we we think we have uh, also we need also uh, a strong cooperation between operators. Uh, if CTT can ha help other operators in this uh, with this experience, we uh, we must do that. Um, if other operators, uh, I see, uh, I know, I think that other operators could uh, also have uh, an important uh, uh, work in this, in this, in this uh, 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 road safety. Um, training the the new the responsibles in this, these operators to develop the, the new guide. Uh, the new, the new road safety programs. Uh, we would like to recognize the best work uh, in this area uh, with the creation of the UPU Road Safety Award. And we would like also to uh, have an uh, annual uh, global UPU Road Safety Conference to, uh, to um, allow to uh, every post companies share uh, their own um, their own, own work. And finally, we need top management support uh, we, uh, in each operator and um, uh, in uh, UPU, of course. Uh, we have uh, also a, a same proposal like the, the commitment of personal operators and the celebration of uh, UPU road safety events. I don't know. I, I, it's the end of uh, the, my presentation. I think now Don must tell something. I don't. It's miss. Uh, we have uh, about uh, seven or eight minutes yet. Okay. Thanks. Thanks, Josie. I'm late. I'm uh, so a very good timing. So for all you haven't known me, my name is Lei. I'm working for. Uh, transport related activities here in Universal Postal Union. Uh, and thanks you for your sharing based on your very profound um, analysis and profound insight. So I would like to know anyone on, uh, online here would like to you know, ask a few questions to Josie because we maybe we, we can have a three or four minutes Q&A session because we maybe we need to close this webinar at 4 p.m. So if anyone has a question, you can just raise your uh, virtual hand so I can give the floor to you and Josie can help take the answer, take the question. I don't, I don't see here, uh, maybe here, uh, no. No, uh, no one raised their hand. Uh, uh, no, we, I, I think we have uh, still uh, about uh, uh, six certain. minutes. Yeah, six minutes uh, left. If someone uh, has some questions, uh, uh, of course, uh, later you can also always contact me. Uh, I think um, um, uh, my contacts are here, in my mail, and my 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 phone, uh, but. Uh, um, we have four minutes now, I suppose. Uh, if you want, uh, you can uh, raise your hand and uh, and 
you can make some question if you want. If you don't want, okay, <laughs> just wait two minutes. So uh, if no one asks the question, so I will try to close this webinar by saying some a few words, okay? Uh, first okay. one, okay, so I would like to thank Josie first. You are very excellent. Thank you for sharing this, you know, with very detailed information and practical information. I'm really impressed by the case study you share with us. And let us know that road safety is everyone's responsibility. I think we all have our parts to do and we all have our, our role to play. So this is my, you know, very uh, thoughts understand after your presentation. And also on behalf of my team, my, uh, I would also like to express my gratitude to all the participants online here. I can see that there are still 24 participants here. Uh, thank you, thank you for coming. Without you, this webinar cannot be possible. I think it's very important that we all um, come together for such a dialogue from time to time and focus on specific topic and important topics like safety and security. And I do hope that um, some of the information you pick up today from this webinar and take home can be useful and can help you to some extent can better understand you know, the very complex situation and the very significant challenges when it comes to safety and security in our environment, especially in the postal sector and the supply chain. Uh, and just now we can see that there is a survey at the end of this webinar. This will tell us more about what your major concerns are and will also let us know what should be the top priorities to focus on this topic. So we would appreciate it if you can take a few minutes to go through the survey and let us know your point, let us know your voice. This will definitely help us to drive some activities forward. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Take thank care. you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.